I am going to demonstrate three artifact template features introduced in version 403 of RQM. First is the ability to delete predefined templates. Today, when you create an artifact, a test case here, you are presented with a list of templates that can be used for creating the test case. The template defines which sections are initially to be part of the test case. The list of templates here are those predefined ones added to the project when it was created. The option to now delete templates can help simplify the creation of test artifacts by reducing or eliminating the number of templates an author can choose from when creating an artifact. To delete templates, go to the Manage Artifact Templates UI. For this demonstration, I'm going to eliminate all but one test case template. Now, when I create a test case, there is no option to select a template as there was only one defined. The second feature I will show is the ability to customize predefined sections. Let's create a new test case template. We'll give it a name. We're also going to want to include the test case execution records section. I want the summary to be the first section. Now I'm going to edit the summary section. I'm going to change its name and change its description. Note there is only one summary section definition. Editing the section here will also affect how it appears in other test case templates. I want this new template to be the default. And they also no longer need the old test case template. And now I'll go and create a new test case. And we see the summary section is now overview and has my new definition. Going back to manage templates. The last new feature to demonstrate is the ability to predefine content for sections. This applies to all sections that contain rich text. We'll add the test case design to our template. We're going to edit it. We'll change the description. And predefine some content. Save this section definition. We'll make this section our first section. Save the template definition and create a new test case. And here's our test case design section with its predefined content. That concludes my demo. Thank you for watching.